Whatever I tell you is truth. I have researched or I have experienced everything that I tell you and I know that it works 100%. I will not come on here telling y'all stuff that, hey, she just fine and stuff, making it. No, 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 I don't do that. It's kind of hard for me to lie. That's one thing I'm going to tell you. That's one fact about me. I cannot lie. If I lie, well, yes, I can. I can lie. I can lie. Everybody lie. I can lie to get myself out of trouble. Hello, everyone. Okay, let me start off by saying hello to my new subscribers and thank you for subscribing to my channel. Today's video is going to be a very quick video. I basically just want to come on and share with everyone a quick solution that I have to get rid of eczema. Okay, but first of all, before I go any further, let me just show you this picture. Okay, I don't know if you were if you noticed, but there were little bumps. That's Nadia on the photo. That's a picture of the back of her hand. From time to time it flares up, either in the summertime, wintertime, it'll just flare up. Sometimes um, on her cheeks, it'll flare up. It can flare eczema can flare up anywhere. If you suffer with eczema or know someone who does, you know eczema, it'll just show up whatever it wants to show up okay so with Nadia on that picture I think it flared up as her hair needed to be washed so um, Haley's like that too when the scalp is dirty and just say I've gone more than a week or so or if they're you know without washing the hair and they're outside playing you never know I'm sure outside in the dirt at school playing and I don't get around to washing the hair the little bumps will flare up their scalp so I check their scalp like often so as soon as I see, if I see that I do go ahead and wash um, their hair and the eczema does go away well the little bump goes away okay so the first thing well the first thing you want to do is if you see just say on the face let's just say on the face but it can be anywhere on the body if you see eczema flare up on the cheeks First thing you want to do is wash the face. Why well, use the Johnson & Johnson head to toe body wash and kind of cleanse the face. And then I'll follow up with this uh, medication. It is, um, can you see that? I do get a prescription from the doctor for this, but this is a very, 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 very effective medication. The name of it is hydrocortisone. I think it's pronounced Valerate. It's spelled V-A-L-E-R-A-T-E -E cream, USP, 0.2%. Uh, and I'll include a picture of this at the end of the video. It's really cheap with my insurance. I don't know how much it is without insurance, but I think I only pay like $5. Yeah, uh, let me just say this. I'm not a doctor. I'm not trying to be a doctor. I don't want to be a doctor. But because this works so well, I wanted to share it with y'all um, because I recently saw a little baby that the little cheeks had little bumps. You know how the little, they call it hive or whatever. I don't know if it was hive or just eczema. I don't even know if it's a difference with that. But the child had like little bumps and the face was all red and uh, looked bruised. And so went so far as to put some in like a little piece of aluminum foil and take it to the mom and you know show her how to use it and sure enough probably within 15 to 30 minutes it was clearing up the little bumps the little bumps were clearing up and also the little redness of the skin because the redness of the skin is pretty much just irritation this is the medication that I use let me just show you what it looks like so what you this is what it looks like when you squeeze it out you just get some off it's white you know that's a lot you really don't need that much but even if you use this much on like a spot it will not affect the child's skin where well, it hasn't affected Nadia's or Haley's skin because I just get it and squirt it on my hand and then you want to put it directly on yeah that's too much see that's too much and I still got some more here but you just want to uh, get it and put it on the um, the little rash and just rub it in rub it in 
and it will dissolve and I did too much so you don't really need that much just a little bit and as you can see it's gone so it does you just rub it until you can't see it anymore and it has my hand is now somewhat shiny and so you put the top make sure you put the top back on it because it will dry out and then you're going to follow with aquaphor now aquaphor this is really 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 good um and um my uh the pediatric i'm sorry i was thinking <laughs> for dry cracked and irritated skin so what it does let me just show you what it looks like and I, this stuff, it lasts so long. I bought this. Uh, you don't have to buy it this big. But um, I think it was on sale. And then I had a coupon. So, hey, I was like, let me just get the big one. Since, you know. Because it, it is kind of pricey. I think maybe like a little tube of it is probably like, let me just say 7 to $10. Depending on where you uh, get it from. You can get it from Walmart, Walgreens, CVS, Target. And so, this is what it looks like, y'all. It looks like um, Vaseline, but I actually think it's better than Vaseline. So after you put the little cream on and rub it in, you just get a little bit, just a little bit on your finger, and then go over the same spot that you put the cream on. So what this is going to do is condition the skin. Uh, let me see what's on the back. So the first. Um, ingredient is mineral oil. I know a lot of people are like, oh, I don't like mineral oil. Um, and there's some more stuff on here. Glycerin. Um, but yeah, so you put this on and immediately your skin is going to be conditioned and it's going to be really, really shiny. Now, what you don't want to do is put too much because if you put too much, your child or you, you're going to be walking around shining, <laughs> looking all greasy. And I know you don't want to be looking greasy. So, hey, just a little bit, just in the spot that, you know, the eczema has flared up. Wait about, I'll say probably about 15 minutes, 15 to 30 minutes, and you will see it disappear. I don't know what's in this stuff. But it is the bomb, okay? This, this is a really, really, really great medication. I, like I said, I've been using this since Nadia was newborn all over the body. Even if it flares up, hey, I get this, put it on there, and the eczema, the little bumps, and the little bruise or rash, whatever, goes away ASAP. Also, you may want to, um, as far as eczema, Okay, how do I say this? We may, we, including myself, we may want to um, be mindful of our diet. And I am not a doctor. I have no intent to become a doctor. Because I really think that it's something internal that's causing the problem with the skin. Something with the blood. It's always about the blood, y'all. The blood, the blood, the blood. I think that's it, y'all. Again, I just want to come on here and share with y'all uh, my solution for getting rid of eczema within 15 to 30 minutes. Um, be sure if you, I, I highly recommend getting this. Um, you know, talking to your doctor, your pediatrician uh, about this um, medication. It works. I don't care if you're black, you're white, Asian, whatever race you are it works it works the lady that um, I was just telling y'all about that I shared the product with her she, I think she was white oh, I dropped it I think she was white but she could have been Hispanic because she looked Hispanic but I don't know hey y'all so anyway that is it be sure to leave comments questions suggestions um 
and be sure to like 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 be sure to subscribe to my channel uh, you can also join me on Facebook at Cordelia Williams Miss Mississippi and until the next video y'all bye bye